TLE Cookery 10 Most Essential Learning Competency Learning Outcome 3 Cook and Plate Poultry and Game Bird Dishes At home, do you cook poultry dishes? Do you plate or present it well so your family will like it that much? By the way, which came first, chicken or egg? According to the Bible, in the book of Genesis, it shares a story of how the earth came about which includes the creation of heaven, light, the seas, the sky, animals, and finally, the first man and woman. The first mention of our feathery friends or fowls, as they are more generally known in the Bible, comes in verse 20. At some point in evolutionary history, when there were no chickens, two birds that were almost but not quite chickens mated and laid an egg and that hatched into the first chicken. If you are prepared to call that egg a chicken's egg, then the egg came first. Are you confused? You must not. So what matters most is the importance of creation of poultry animals and game birds. Poultry can be cooked with almost any cooking method, but the age of the bird often controls the best method to use. The youngest birds are the tenderest and are best cooked with dry heat methods. The meat of older birds is much tougher and usually needs moist heat cooking methods. Further, the way food is presented affects a person's perception on how it will taste. What are the principles of poultry cookery? You read the following. What are the two methods of cooking poultry animals? Number one, moist heat method. Number two, dry heat method. Moist heat method. Poultry animals can be cooked with moist or water. Common Filipino dishes are tinola, sinampalokong manok, manok na pinaupo, and it Dry heat method. The dry heat method is usually reserved for young tender poultry. The poultry of class of these chickens is especially termed broilers and fryers. Somewhat older but still immature birds such as capons and roasters are also suitable for roasting. They are still tender but have more fat than the broilers and fryers. Take note! Older birds need to be tenderized by moist cooking prior to dry heat cooking. One point to remember in poultry cookery, moist heat cookery may be applied to all classes and kinds of poultry, but dry heat cookery is reserved for tender and birds. Continue watching this video, read it with your eyes, take note, and understand the concepts for you to be able to familiarize it and apply these concepts to your hands-on activity at home. How to do control portion sizes, portion control secrets, portion versus serving. A portion is how much food you choose to eat at one time. Whether in a restaurant, from package, or in your own kitchen, portions can be bigger or smaller than the recommended food servings. There is no standard portion size and no single right or wrong portion. A 
serving size is the amount of food listed on a product's nutrition facts or the amount of food recommended in the food guide pyramid and the dietary guidelines for Americans. Sometimes, the portion size and serving size match. Sometimes, they do not. Take note. A serving is a standard amount used to help give advice about how much to eat or to identify how many calories and nutrients are in a food. Let's proceed to principles in presenting or plating poultry dishes. What are the factors to consider? The types of service wares, sauces, plating, accompaniments, and garnishing. One principle in plating a dish is a creative food presentation techniques. Next, plating the food. Take note. Decorate the frame. Take note. Mix shapes, colors, and textures. Garnishes. Next, activities. Let us have activities. I want everyone at home to participate, okay? You can answer with your mind or take note. Are you ready? Activity 1. That's the way we cook it. Directions. Complete the organizer of poultry cookery. The circle. Methods of cooking in rectangle, Filipino dishes, triangle, classes of poultry and square, meat content. Refer to the words or group of words below. Let us start from the circle. What are the two methods of cooking? What are your answers? Dry heat and moist heat. Very good. How about the rectangle? What are the Filipino dishes under dry heat? Chicken in a sal? What else? Pritong manok? What else? Relleno? How about the moist heat? What are the Fili Filipino dishes under moist heat method? Adobong manok? Pininyahang manok? And tinola? Let's proceed to triangle. What are the classes of poultry under dry heat method? Tender poultry. How about the moist heat? What class of poultry? The matured poultry. Let's proceed to square. What are the meat content of tender poultry? Lean meat. And under matured poultry, fatty meat. Let's proceed to activity 2, true or false. Directions. Answer true if the idea is correct 
in the concepts of presenting poultry dishes and falls if it is not. Number 1. The way food is presented affects a person's perception of how it will taste. True or false? The correct answer is true. Number 2. Presentation should look unusual. What is the answer? It's false. Number 3. Always check the temperature of food before serving. True or false? True. 4. Decorating the rim of the plate will result to messy presentation. True or false? False. And number 5. Use odd and not even numbers of dishes for further interest. The correct answer is true. Since you know the different concepts, I want you all to do an activity to apply it. Regardless of who you are, your gender, where you came from, your lifestyle, what belief you have, Christian or Muslim, you participate. This is an individual activity. And 70% of your grade in cookery will come from your performance task. Directions At home, following the concepts of poultry cookery and presenting poultry dishes, cook and plate any poultry dish. Take note! You can ask help from family, be creative and resourceful, be organized and clean. Simple yet elegant output may do. If you are done, have a photo of it and send to your teacher via messenger. Here are some of the performance tasks of grade 10 students. Good job, guys! Did you learn something new today? Let us have a generalization. You answer it on your own. Number one, how important is knowing all the principles of poultry cookery? Number two, why do we need to plate or present well a dish? Number three, how to present food creatively. And number four, what have you learned from our lesson today? Let's have a summative assessment. Just copy this link to your browser. For your assignment, just copy this link to your browser. Take note, you write your answers in a paper and have it submitted by your parents during distribution and retrieval day. Keep safe everyone! Goodbye class!